What's going on YouTube? It's been a while since I've done a video of my pond. Last year we started digging a new pond. Well, I dug part of the pond probably 2016. Um, and then I started um, digging the pond again in 2017. Just wanted to give you an update of the new pond. Let you check it out. You can you know, give me some good comments. Um, if you look at some of my videos, you will see what the pond started off like. 2016 and now you can see what the pond looks like 2019 here is the new pond still got a little bit of more work a little bit a little bit more work to do um, if you look at some of my videos you will see um, me feeding bluegills I've restocked the pond over again and a lot of the bluegills survived from the earlier pond, so I'm excited about that. But as you can see, some of them biting here now. And I really want to um, get a Texas Pro Feeder, one of those Texas feeders. I like those Texas feeders. So if anybody have any um, Texas Pro Feeders or Texas Hunter Feeders, um, let me know. Be glad to get one. If you want to donate one, I'd be greatly appreciative. But here is some of the pond right here. Here is the pond. I got to do a little bit of drainage issue. I've got some water draining outside of the pond, so I got to fix that area right there. But I'm getting ready to um, fix that in a couple of weeks. But this is the pond thus far. I went out earlier today on my little small boat over here and I caught a six pound bass. Threw him back in and caught a little um, four pound bass, threw him back in. But just wanted to give you an update of what the pond looks like. It's been a long time since I've done a video. I think I'm gonna start doing them pretty frequently now. One of my major issues of this pond, I have a lot of these things called coon tails or cattails or something like that. You can see them in the bottom. Cattails, I guess that's what it's called. So I bought some um, aquatic pesticide spray or aquatic um, spray and sprayed some of them and they're dying. But just want to, I guess it's just the nature of the beast of owning a pond. But just want to give you a little view of the pond, let you see where I'm at right now. You can see baby bass down in the bottom. So far, I have put into this pond probably um, 2,000 bluegills, probably 200 channel catfish, uh, probably 10 bass. But I'll be honest with you, I'm counting 50 and 60 bass thus far i mean it's like i guess they're they're starting to uh have babies and so which is a good thing i guess the pond size is one point acre almost two acre pond these are my two little boats right here i gotta do some more drainage issues so i can get my slope like this the excavator he's a little busy right now so he'll get back to me when he can but here's the pond right here. Here's another angle of it. I wanted you to see that as well. Here's another angle of the pond. You can see fish all down in the bottom, but you see a lot of that coon tail stuff. But here's my pond. I put two aerators in there. A guy from St. Isidore's farm recommended to put aerators in there, and I put those in last week. This is my pond. And before anyone asks me, I'm going to let you know right now, those are fake ducks. Those are fake swans I put in the pond. Fake swans. I just bought me a dump truck, a little small dump truck that I can use. Um, got tired of renting dump trucks, and so I found one, and I bought it so I can use around my place. But this is my pond. Just wanted you all to check it out. 
Tell me what you think. Give me some good comments of some things you maybe can help me to make it a little bit better. It's a two acre pond. Just want to say thank you all for just tuning into my channel. Um, it's been a it's been a little journey. Still got a little bit ways to go. Just trying to get everything prepared for spring. You know, spring means a lot of fish. Babes are being um, born, and just want to be able to have a a good amount of food. I do feed my fish. I feed them two times a day. I feed them this Aqua um, MVP. It's a multi-sized pellet food. It is 46% protein. I buy it from my local hardware store where they order it for me. But um, I feed them twice a day. I have copper nose, bluegill. Um, I just added some red breasts in here and some shell cracker as well. There's a big bass right there. I don't know if you can see that bass, but there's a big bass right there. It looks like he's about 14, 15 inches. But um, yeah, so this is the pond. Started out, uh, I think, April of 2016. Um, just finished up probably October or November of 2017. So it took a little while. Worked with a certain budget. But um, still got a little bit more work to go. But just wanted you to check it out. Tell me what you think. All right. Take care.